hi welcome to my channel today i want to talk about millennials and how we can save money during this pandemic that has no end in sight oh my god and which has us brought such immense financial constraints because we're seeing more and more people get laid off of work um, we're seeing the cafe which is also bringing down businesses others are getting pay cuts others are going on unpaid leave and so the financial situation is just not the best right now and getting your finances right and cushioning yourself for the uncertain future is very important so how do you do that as a young millennial one is by ditching the packet milk imagine compared to the tasky's pasteurized milk which goes for 60 shillings a liter the packet milk goes for 50 bob just ditch it and go for the pasteurized milk for your daily use uh, the teas and the coffees and the cereals just use the pasteurized milk if you have a child then one or two packets of milk is important for them to drink but me and you know kumeni maze la tasky nse and if you don't have a tasky near you i know mtani kuna kongana milk bars if you're feeling ish about it it's not the time to give those people side eyes <laughs> buy one for like 20 bob or 40 shillings and you know go boil it and see how it is before you conclude that the milk is bad but it's the way to save to save money by buying the pasteurized milk two is try and do more homemade meals this is not the time to um uber eats all the time so do um kina ndomas the 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 njahes the mboshos the kundes the ndinguz and the kamandes so go to cereal shops shop for those dry grains and milk prep some sort you know just boil them and have them in your fridge and then go on pinterest and youtube and find fun ways to personalize those milk so that you don't get bored but saving on your milk is a really big way this is also the time to go speak to mama mboga and find out about the mboga za kenyeji you always hear about the managus the kundes the mandas the what else the um, chichas and find out how they are cooked Ganyan does not jump shaka blaze ja pikwa nini zinafanya nini no just find out and buy them imagine for like that table there are so many and then mboga za kenyeji ni kamu <laughs> so buy mboga za kenyeji buy cereals if it's staples like rice my friend extra must for market just go to the cereal shop find the singanos the basmati the pilau rice and the which other one the moares as well a kilo would for example go for like 70 bob um for the sindano compared to imagine compare that to the price of rice in supermarkets so that's a huge 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 way to um to save your money um another one is doing your shopping in wholesale shops i know sometimes they look dingy especially the less i'm tiny you're like hey, i'm sure those things are legit but for stuff like toiletries and i'm talking about um toilet papers detergents bathing soaps toothpaste body oil sanitary towels and baby products like diapers those things you can most definitely buy from the wholesale shops which are um, usually have the products um discounted now listen you might not get the quality um not the quality the brands that you usually get from the supermarkets but that does not mean does not mean that you cannot try other brands remember these are not consumables and so you can you know you can bend around if it's tissue if they don't have one brand you can always try another and so wholesale shopping will definitely see you cut your cost shop into half um what else now they also sell consumables yeah kina unga and scary now I, i i i'm in no position to advise whether you can buy them or not because i also know people who sell their margarines and their cooking oils in those wholesale shops as well so if you if you would want to you should try them out they're consumables um if you want to you could try out the small packets first see how they are are they legit is the quality really nice then you can decide whether to buy them or not but you can also ask around you know the people around have used the stuff from that shop how are they 
ask people around where do you guys buy your wholesale stuff from in town i know downtown town um mm, why is this place otc where the task is is just just beside the task is is a whole line of wholesale shops that sell those products at really discounted price so you really consider doing your shopping in those places and not even during quarantine time only even after corona these are really nice trims that you can get um good value for your money another one is riding on promotions and sales this is not the time to feel oh my god oh, it's time to just um, be very keen shop around to see who has or what product has um, a sale or a discount it's not a must to use the same quite um, the same um, commodity or brand i mean you don't have to use the same brand over and again if the, the commodity is there but a different brand which is cheaper i think it's a time to reconsider your spending and you know try um the products that are on sale and the ones that have been promoted and also the cheaper ones because what we're trying to do right now is cushion ourselves for the uncertain period that is ahead of us because you know it's just crazy we're just getting um updates of five people today 10 people tomorrow 12 people the other day and so it's just a, a pandemic as i said that has no end in sight and ensuring that you are cushioned well properly financially for the uncertain time is very 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 important thank you so much for watching um if you're feeling stuck please um ask for help even for your, from your parents um call on your friends ask them how they serving during this time of um a pandemic you know don't just sit around if you can get your parents to send you food you know the likes that i have talked about them brochures and the whatnot definitely call on them and get them um delivered to your home so that's it guys ways that you can save your money as a young millennial um during this time of um a pandemic that oh my god oh god is this <laughs> oh my god anyway thank you so much for watching and do subscribe to my youtube channel for more informative content like this and educative drop me a comment how you um looking to save your money during this time and i think that's it for today we're gonna talk a little more later bye